at the TPC River Highlands in Cromwell. The driver behind these drives is charity. And it's over $3 million. And the day is dedicated to that. Like, there is no question it's my favorite day of the year. But it's the celebration of what the tournament did over the summer. For the Travelers Championship, this is their charity celebration. Tournament director Nathan Groob says $3 million was raised in 2023. $3 million going to 181 charities, the ripple effect uh, that that's going to have on our community and the people that they serve, like, I mean, how can that not be the most inspiring thing to just to see what they're going to do with those funds that you've, you've helped them raise? Talk about an elevated event. The Travelers Championship wasn't just elevated for the golfers on the course. For charities, it was elevated as well, 20% over last year. That's why today's so exciting, because we hit $3 million. And since we've taken over the tournament in 07, we've given over $28 million to over 900 organizations. To me, that's what this is all about. Among the beneficiaries, the Hole in the Wall gang camp in Ashford. For us in particular, it really means that we can dream our biggest dream and work with more and more children all over the place who need us, and that's really special to us. For the Hospital for Special Care, programs like Birdies for Charity mean more ALS research. Support like this that comes from the Travelers Championship in Mahoney Sable actually helps us secure places um, and other resources, including new clinical trials from the National Institutes of Health. It is one of the few days in golf where the high score wins. We're not going to stop here. We never accept the status quo. The current year isn't good enough. Now we push ahead and we got to get better for next year. In Cromwell, Jim Altman, Fox 61, Connecticut's news station.